An Eva Beach family is pleading for help to find out who shot their dog with a BB gun. They believe whoever it was came back a few days later and did it again. And now the dog's health is in serious jeopardy. Manola Morales reports. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come here, baby, I know, I know, my love. Come Ziggy, an English bulldog, hasn't been himself in the past week. At two years old, he's normally a bundle of energy and loves playing with the kids. His family initially thought he had some kind of infection until they found BB gun pellets inside his wounds. This was the first one. You can see it's kind of getting healed. That was disturbing enough, but then they found fresh wounds a few days later. I woke up and he had a new one right in his paw and then he had more. And then just last night, we found three more. So whoever is doing this, um, it's more than one occasion. It's more, they came back. Ziggy normally likes to stay outside during the day and he stays in this cage. The family tells me whoever did this must have gotten real up close when they shot him multiple times. It's kind of like violating, like you feel terrifying to know that there's somebody that can keep coming here. Boudreau says there are several more BBs inside Ziggy's body that need to be taken out, but the priority for the vet right now is to take out what's causing his nose to constantly bleed. See? Boudreau worries that Ziggy's health is deteriorating. I don't want to find him dead, you know? I don't want my kids to find him dead. I don't want my babies to find him dead, you know? that's. Just... She has no idea who would do this and why. I hope, you know, if they see this, you know, I hope that you know that you're causing harm. It's not just a game. It's not just a pellet gun. That's, you're hurting him. You're hurting our family, you know? Even the kids are having a hard time dealing with it. She went to school and she was crying. And the teacher called me. She's like, what's going on at home? And I'm like, no, no, don't worry. We're, my, my dog is getting shot. And so then we kind of, you know, had to update everybody and let them know. HPD has opened a first-degree animal cruelty case, which is a felony. The family has started a GoFundMe page because Ziggy has multiple procedures ahead of him. We'll post a link on khon2.com. Manola Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.